Been waiting a long time for this, huh? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, does it feel like it's been a long time since you showed up for camp on July 20th or whenever it was? Oh man, for sure. I feel like I've been here for a year already. Um, <laughs> It's been it's been fun. It's been a lot, a lot of work, but uh, we're finally getting to the to the real action. So it's gonna be fun. What's changed for you in that time? Uh, nothing much really. Just been keeping the same mentality, just working hard, um, and just you know just showing myself and proving to myself that I belong. So that's what I've just been doing this whole time. Greg, has there been a point where your DB coach or coordinator or head coach said you're starting in Kansas City? Uh, no, not really. Um, I do, he just told us yesterday in meetings that I was, but before that, you know, I'm just me and Greedy both preparing to be the starters, both competing against each other, um, and both rooting for each other. Who was that? You said he. Oh, uh, me and Greedy. Are oh, you talking about who was the coach? Yeah. DB coach. I don't want my day. Which one? Coach Howard. When you look at that Kansas City film, Greg, what uh, what one thing stands out to you most? I mean, they're just a very talented offense in general. Um, you know, they got a lot of great players on the offense, so it's definitely going to be a fun game. They uh, kind of set the standard offensively, at least in the AFC, with, with what they did. So what went through your mind when you saw that schedule come out when your first NFL game was going to be against the two-time defending conference champs? Oh, no, it's definitely super exciting. Um, what a way to start off your rookie season. <laughs> um, but definitely super excited to, you know, have the opportunity to play a team like that. Hey, there was a game a couple years ago where the Rams beat the Chiefs 50. Mm -hmm. three years ago. Rams end up going to the Super Bowl, so their defense was pretty good. Can you imagine, I mean, what would you feel like if that game, this game turns into that kind of track meet? I mean, it would, I mean, we obviously don't like teams scoring 51 points, but at the end of the day, a win is a win. So um, we're not really, you know, looking forward to, you know, the Super Bowl things and, and all that stuff. We're just trying to focus uh, one week at a time. Did you watch that Chiefs-Browns game last year? Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. I mean, what, what did you think as you were watching? You obviously didn't know you were going to be here. Yeah, I mean, um, it shows the Browns are a very talented team. The Chiefs are a very talented team. It was a great game. Um, and, you know, we're definitely looking forward to play this one, too. Are you getting a sense in the, the building from the guys that were in that game, the excitement to kind of go against them? I mean, for sure. We, you know, we're just honestly excited to just play the first game in general. Like, just those. Um, just that excitement. We've been here for a long time preparing to finally go to the regular season and play a game. And obviously against the Chiefs is definitely going to be fun too. Congratulations on being the top rookie. I don't know if you knew that, but the media voted you as the top rookie for the camp. Can you just reflect on winning that award and your training camp? Yeah, I actually really didn't know that too much, but um, you know, it's an honor. Obviously I've been here very long time working hard. It's uh, been some ups, it's been some downs, but you know, like I said, every single day, I'm just trying to get 1% better um, every single day. And then, you know, it would, it would lead me to success ultimately. So um, I'm just trying to just work out here and get better every single day. And, you know, it's credit to the guys I get to play like Jarvis, Odell, Donovan, the whole receiver room is preparing me um, every single day. And also thanks to my, you know, teammates, my defensive backs like Greedy and Ward and Troy Hill, um, John, all of those guys, you know, they um, help me every single day and they just preach for me to go out there and play fast. So I wouldn't, you know, be able to be where I am without those guys for sure. What's the most hostile environment you ever played in? Uh, probably the Big Ten Championship. At Indianapolis? Yeah. Was that a full house? Yeah. You were aware of the Arrowhead crowd? Is that something you know about? Um, I mean, not really, not too much. Um, I definitely heard it was loud for sure, so it's definitely going to be fun in there. Got to stick like glue to your guy for probably a long time because you just you never know when he's gonna get rid of that ball. I mean that's just in the job description against you know any quarterback. Obviously Pat Mahomes is arguably one of the best quarterbacks in the whole National Football League. So you know it's just what we've been doing every single day out here is just sticking to your man. Um, you know you got to play the whole play through. Um, that's at the end of the day that's what we got to do. Uh, to be successful. Greg, how much has it helped the last week? You got three regulars coming back late last week, Greedy, Taki Taki, and I forget who else yet, a bunch of guys on the sideline. How much has that helped just to get everybody out there in those in that first rotation groups to get that continuity going? Yeah, it's definitely helped. Um, you know, before they were injured, I feel like, you know, we had it going as well. And, you know, as soon as they came back, it just, we gelled right again. So it was definitely great to see those guys, you know, come back. They've been having an unbelievable camp. So it's definitely good to see them come back. 
So your first NFL game is against Patrick Mahomes. What do you think about that? Oh, it's definitely going to be fun. Um, you know, I can't wait to get out there. Um, you know, first NFL game in general is going to be amazing, but obviously going against um, a two-time AFC champion is going to be fun. So you have one interception at Northwestern, and what if you got one in your first game? Uh, that, would, that would be amazing. Um, I'm just going to, you know, obviously try to stick and do my job, and, you know, hopefully some of those opportunities come. Will you be nervous before the uh, first snap? I mean, I'm nervous before every single game, just a little. I feel like nerves is a, is a way to show that you care. Um, you wouldn't be nervous about anything that you don't care about. So um, I'll definitely be nervous, but I'll definitely be ready to play too. How much of a goal was it for you to earn that starting nod entering your rookie season? What was your reaction like when you found out yesterday? Yeah, honestly, um, that's always a goal I said before. I think every corner in the room, their goal should be starting. Um, but that really wasn't my primary goal. My primary goal was to just get as comfortable as I can with the scheme, get as comfortable with the guys out there, and just to get better every single day. Um, and I knew if I got better every single day, then I'll put myself in the position where my coaches can uh, you know, make some decisions on to who's starting. So uh, my goal is just to get better every single day. You talked on Patrick a little bit, but how would you describe this offense when they have Mahomes and Tyreek and Travis Kelsey and there's an array of weapons, so to speak, offensively? Just electric. Yeah. Do you think that, I mean, first game, or they you expect Patrick to come at you early and often? I mean, I you? yeah. I mean, I expect any any quarterback to come at me. I mean, we got a proven guy, um, one of the best corners in the league, in Denzel Ward. We got you know two proven safeties. We got a proven nickel. Even Greedy is a proven guy as well. So I mean, I think that's that's rookies in, across the league is going to get targeted early. JOK said he uh, talked to his dad the other day. He said you don't get any warm up yeah, oh, at all going against the Chiefs. Have, sure. you, have you been having similar conversations with anybody? Uh, no, not really. Um, I mean, I get, I, I, I believe against every single team is no warm up. I mean, especially when the season gets going. I mean, you got to be ready to go. Every team has unbe unbelievable players out there. So um, the Chiefs is, is definitely going to be a fun game. Though.